Nice weather, too, and we're getting it. Yes, we are. Mm -hmm. uh, cannot argue with the forecast we had yesterday. Today, starting off even cooler. More spots in the yeah. 50s this morning. Are you kidding me? For middle of July, we'll take it. Summits in early this morning. That first glow of sunrise starting off the day, and temperatures there in the 50s, 59 degrees right now in West Alabama. More 50s, more 50s than we had yesterday. 57 in Coleman, 58 in Hamilton, 60. Fayette, 62 Birmingham. We've got 60 in Asheville. Pair of 59s from Gadsden down to Anison at 58 early this morning in Talladega. And the dew points are very low. That's the measure of how much humidity is in the air. Anything below 70 during the summertime is notable. Anything below 60 during this time of year is downright fantastic. And that's what we'll have again for today. So we don't expect a whole lot of cloud cover today. Maybe some high clouds moving through. And that's it. More of the same for Friday. I think maybe a few more of those cumulus clouds starting to develop, some of those puffy white clouds for Friday. And then Saturday, we start to see a little bit more moisture in the air. And that'll be the big change that we see. But not everyone will feel those changes, especially in our northern viewing area. Some spots will still st uh, stay with dew points in the upper 50s and low 60s. Temperatures for Friday. You see numbers starting to get a little bit warmer now, starting to get closer to our seasonal averages, which we should be in the low 90s for afternoon highs. But I think today we stay dry and we stay cooler than average. And really not a whole lot changes here over the deep south. We stay dry for today, dry for Friday. You start to see a little bit more rain creep in to south Alabama, south Georgia. And then by Saturday and Sunday, the weekend ahead, better rain chances closer to the I-85 corridor. For Saturday, but most of us here in central Alabama stay dry. But like we said, down to our south, it seems like we'll start to see a little bit more moisture in the air. Temperatures, though, stay below average. Now, this is the temperature trend for the next six to ten days. You see, from the Great Lakes region, the upper Midwest, all the way down to the Gulf Coast, high temperatures stay below average, where most of the other parts of the country will be above average as far as temperatures go. So we still get to enjoy. So at least a little respite from the really hot stuff we saw last week and the week before. More sunshine, mid to upper 80s once again. It stays comfortable with that low humidity, a little easterly breeze. A little bit milder for tonight and early tomorrow morning. I think more spots in the mid 60s for early on Friday. And then that seven day forecast starts off mostly sunny through the start of the weekend, but that humidity comes back by Saturday and Sunday, and then more stray showers and storms Monday. Increased rain coverage by Tuesday and Wednesday. That's your forecast.